Hello from beautiful, perfect, sublime Adelaide, where we are at a bar, just having a, just having a, a bit of dinner, uh, a glass of plonk, and just enjoying everything that the Australian summer has to offer, including Runs Deluxe San Perry. Thank you, here goes. Uh, I think the first word does go to Adelaide. Um, yeah, what a place. Finally, summer has begun. Yeah. Finally, I feel a dry heat. And why is that? It's because I'm going to a geography of the country where the La Nina isn't quite affecting as much. Is uh, it, is also, it? also tomorrow's going to be 35 and bushfire season has started. Really nice to walk out the back of the members at Adelaide and get lambasted by 18,000 blokes between the <laughs> ages of 18 to 24 with Ralph Lauren uh, button-ups. Yep. Uh, nevertheless, wonderful to be broadcasting from here. Yep. Shall we review the day's play? I think the Warner stuff is kind yeah, of... It's, 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 it's calm, it's gone. Okay, okay. And one, now we're back into Australia versus one West Indies. One question for me, one question for me. Uh, what's the uh, cylinder engine on that uh, Mustang walking past? Um, all I want to know is how long are we going to do this before someone um, kicks us out? But what I want to know is really who barbecued who? Who barbecued who? Was it Cam Green's fault? Was it Travis Head's fault? Whose fault was it? It was... It was it was, it was Greeny's fault, Deluxe, 110%. Yeah. Just use your vocal box, which is two metres tall. It's the size of your body. He's a baby giraffe. He hasn't grown into his body yet, and he hasn't grown into his mind. Yeah. And Be it's, a inter- it's interesting because Hedy, uh, the, 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 old, the old bin lid uh, bollocked yeah. him a bit. Yeah, gave him a little the, bit the of old, The old bin lid a gave it to him. And a lot of people may say, oh, don't do that to young Cameron, but it's actually a sign of respect. The thing is that Hetty will never play in the IPL or any other format again as a result of that. Yeah. Like that's a big mistake in terms big of big mistake. It's a big mistake in terms of what Hetty may be able to do after his career. Now, yes, today, sure. yes, he achieved his highest ever Test score, possibly the apex of his career. One seventy five at home, Pez. But he bollocked Cameron Green as he uh, as he departed the field, yeah. and he did it rightly so. Yeah. But. That's the end for Hetty. <laughs> he's, he's at, that, that's him done. That's the end. Uh, as the AFP rolls past. Pez, this, this summer, so far, Travis had 99 and 175 today. Both times he's walked off the field thinking, what the fuck has just happened? Yeah. It's another example of when is cricket good. When is cricket good? He's, he's averaging 136 for the summer, but when is cricket good? He was amazing in this game. and He's walked off and he's thinking, fuck sake. This fucking two metre tall, dopey, fucking lanky coat. Yes. He's not lanky. Fucking slender man. Any yeah. danger. You've stitched me up. You've barbecued me. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's the ultimate disrespect to the Windies because Hetty knew that he was about to double up with a double. Right, you know okay. what I mean? Like, okay. like he, was, okay. he was about okay. to get the two. He knew. And he was about to double. He knew. Uh, you got Ricky Ponting calling out Mark Leachman there in the crowd. Mark Leachman, Leachman is what I'm calling Leachman. Mark Leachman. Yep. yep. He's, uh, he's That's Jack's boy. Jack, Jack's boy. <laughs> hey, and, Leachman. Yeah. <laughs> uh, a couple of glasses of plonk here. Uh, uh, but, but yeah, like, like, I mean, Hetty was like, look, you don't get to 175 that easy. No, you don't In do fact, it. ever. Yeah. And he did it. And he was like, yeah. that was... Because when you finish your career, like if you're that good, if you're head... Yeah, tell me about it. If you're Travis Head, Come like, on. You're, you're only going to get one, maybe two chances to go for the, like, to get 250, 260. Yeah, mate. And, mate, and then that, have that, and have that you've number against... You've only got it you fucking nailed it. You nailed like, it. to have that number against your mm. name. Yeah. Because when he's 55... Right. No one's going to know that the West Indies was on in the precipice of, of actually <laughs> capitulating. <laughs> yeah. And that, yeah. in fact, or being a region, in, in, generally. In fact, as we learned from the Caribbean Cricket Podcast, it's a failed construct. <laughs> <laughs> no one knew that. All it's going to yeah. say is Travis Head, 263 yeah. v West Indies yeah. Adelaide. Who was playing? Was, like, was, was, that, was that Bishop Walsh Ambrose? It could have been. Oh, when he's 55, it, was that time. it might be. Is that, that era? But yeah. instead, it's it's just a paltry 175. That's nice. Pez, how would you describe in one word my appetite? Would you describe it as insatiable? Wanting. Now, assume it's a wonton. Yeah. I don't have a wonton appetite, though of a Sunday afternoon occasionally I have a wonton appetite. I tell you what. But you know what, mate? I, my appetite is insatiable. Like Parat Markets for, in Darwin. Fucking little pup. <laughs> little, little, little fucking little wonton lux are there. Believe me. <laughs> Has to be little. Cannot be yeah. a big. No one's ever had a big lux. Oh, a little, little, yeah. little lux are there. Yeah. Um, 
I just want this summer to be stats boosting. And you know what? Yeah. I was I was upset right. when Marnus didn't hit three hundred. That was that, yes. I think that was one of his. They're only, all upset. I that, think that's one of his opportunities in his career of which he may get one more to get a triple. Travis said today that's a two fifty score. And yeah. mate, look at the fucking pus they're facing. Look at the absolute Great fucking word. pus Great word. they are you facing. Know you mate. spell pus p u s. It's p u s. You don't even get a double s on it. No, no. Which is ever to Nessa. Yeah. With you Nessa. Need to say puss. <laughs> These mics aren't on, brothers. <laughs> Little bit of carry, carry on, on here. Yeah, that's Sweet what I'm saying. Sweet Caroline, suck my car. Fucking hell. Um, anyway, so, um, but you know, like today, 175, it's like, okay, 175 is worth, okay, here's how. Here's one for Okay. 175, now, suddenly, fine, so, finally, someone said it. Today, that 175 was either worth zero or the way Cam Green came out and bat, that was worth 450. Because all, all of right. a sudden, it was fucking playing demons. It was playing a couple of all tricks right. of the mind. One of the worst nines off 50 you'll ever see. Yeah, Of which you've seen a few. I, I think Cam Green's um, position's under threat. There's yeah. no doubt about it. I mean, there's, sorry, there's no that, that goes without saying. Mate, after today, he's only yeah. one metres 99. Yeah. He ain't two metres after that shit I saw today. Fuck, he was timid and turgid. Wasn't it bad? And, and internal. Mate, have you seen the footage during the week where he's facing Lance Morris, I'll bear back Morris there? Yeah. Well, um, well we're CA, we're like deliberately trying to fucking kill his IPL prospects. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And he looked awful. And then he actually just brought that energy into the... I mean, he hasn't played first-class cricket since I think the late 90s. So it's been a minute for Cam Green. But like, fuck me, he, he was a guy who looked like he'd not picked up a cricket bat in a long time. I mean, look, I, I'll throw the other side of it. Um, to oh, just devils, to the audience. Well, I'll, de- I'll devils this. Yeah. Um, you may say that like Travis Head and Marnus Labuschagne will never get that chance to uh, make those runs again, except when you acknowledge that the West Indies are coming out here next year. <laughs> <laughs> so if they can just hang on, yeah. and not only and not months. only that, they're coming out with Pakistan. <laughs> so <laughs> who've really, never, who've never won a test really. match here? We say it's a summer Mate, of Marnus. Isn't that and amazing? It's a, it's, it's a fucking Olympic cycle Pakistan. of Marnus. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They, Pakistan or fucking Pakistan. Yeah, yeah, Pakistan. Pakistan. Packet, Packet yeah, yeah, well, a little bit tonight, There's possibly. There's a few blokes on a Packet tonight. Don't yeah. worry about that. Well, let us know. <laughs> it's going to be too late by yeah. the time they do it. I, I, I was keen for someone to, to offer me some Packet tonight, but they kept <laughs> offering it to my dad. <laughs> Who was, was he last there? year? Who was, was he last year? Did you down here? I wouldn't yeah. mind of, uh, offering yeah. him some packet yeah. stuff. <laughs> nah, no, boys had a couple plonks. <laughs> Elvino did flow. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah, so I What's guess... What's next, mate? mate? We're mate, up to next. Mate, Minus 163, uh, Travis whatever. had 175. Uh, you know, it's you just know. fucking stats boosting, mate. And you know what? Yeah, there was a mate, time a, lot, a, a long time... Junk. I'm just going to keep talking here. There's a time a, a little while ago where like we would have killed for just a fucking summer where someone was like boosting stats. I actually did kill a young Indonesian boy over this, and <laughs> so I didn't realise that it wouldn't lead to this for a few years' time. I didn't realise that would manifest until a few years later. So Minus get 163 at the Adelaide Oval. <laughs> I killed an Indonesian what, boy. So you're proving my point. People were killing. I told you, mate. In the past. I, I didn't realise it, it was you or it was that close to home. <laughs> Nevertheless. There's oh, blood on my there hands. Hey, <laughs> uh, what a I, city. I, I, it, it, it's all you can ask. Mm. We're playing threes. They're mm. on the plane. Mate, they're fucking They're threes. injured. It's, 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 it's threes on the plane, pus uh, injured stuff. And guys are scoring runs. Yeah. That, I mean, what, what else do you want? Let, 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 let bring on South Africa. Uh, whatever. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Just it's finish all, off all, the game. It's all a warm. And, and the good news is that... Um, it's good news. How are you, mate? Good, you. guys doing a podcast? Yeah, no, yeah, no, no, yeah. no, this isn't on. Yeah, no, you we're want just, chat? You want to get involved? There's a couple of blokes who are lonely. Yeah, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jump in, make sure you're in, in the yeah. shot. Yeah. G'day, brother. How are you doing tonight? Yeah, you, you said shout-out yeah, to someone. Yeah, do a shout-out, yeah. I, I would like to praise God. And thank you, Jesus Christ, our Lord and Saviour. Thank you. Well, hang on. All right. That's a bit of a gift wrap, isn't All right. it? That's Manus's batting coach. Yeah. Um, okay, so okay. in the second innings... A bit of Sky Daddy stuff. In the, <laughs> in the second innings, um, West Indies find themselves... Well, they find themselves pairs. Four for 102. Um, yeah. the, the game's over. It's now, two, two, I mean, two, two for the lock. And, uh, is, 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 is four what you wanted? I wanted, I wanted six. I wanted six yeah, tonight. Yeah, it's, it's unders. I wanted six tonight. Four's it's unders. unders. It's almost like we're seeing to put up a fight. There's no point to it. We all know what's going to happen in this game. Um, I guess there's a bit of there's a bit of talk where Marsh Labu Skakni could break the Hados record of 500 runs in a two-match series. It's a fucking weird stat. He gives a fuck um, about that. Hayden got 500 runs against Zimbabwe when he hit 380. I'm going to guess that time. 
He needs to hit like seventy nah. or, or fifty Next. or some shit. Yeah, Next. I don't give a fuck. Bin shit. Um, what about what about Marnus breaking three thousand test runs? Second quickest to do it. Bradman did it about half the time. That don't do anything for you. Not nah, not for me, man. Uh, let, let, let's see some overseas now. Yeah. Okay. A uh, couple of wickets there. All right. Should we in the hashtag ICDC? Yeah, go for it. Popular vlog gaming wrote in uh, and getting your hashtag ICDC in the comments below. Said hashtag ICDC Pez. How are the Aussies feeling about baseball next summer? I can tell you, Marnus runs doesn't look great for us Brits next year. Cheers, Sam. Uh, Anything for you? How do we feel about baseball next summer? I think I think the summer in England is going to be fucking hot. I think yeah. it's good shit. I think it's fucking good be from a marketing lo- perspective. There's going to be a lot of dumb shit said from oh, Australia can you imagine ahead of some it. Of the chat? Like they, they are going to be probably courtesy of our questions. Yeah. Goaded into questioning baseball, and that's cool. Uh, a lot of people in the comments, like when we say nice things about England, like, oh, why don't you fucking turn for England, you fucking gay? And we would and as well. It, yeah, and, and I'm kind of like, I like England. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's not a competition to see who's the most Australian. No. You know? No. Uh, no. We, know, we know what we are. No. Well, not as a nation. I mean, I we, think, we, we I voted think, down the Republic mate, in 2000. It was literally less than a year, to, year ago. Remember that Hobart test match when the fucking like, blokes were turning around and kicking him over? They were thinking, get me the fuck out of here. Um, and there were beers on the rooftop of that hotel balcony and the police were involved and all that. And then since then, England have had the most remarkable turnaround. And from a marketing perspective, thank fuck for that. Because this and that's the only 20, perspective. 2023 Ashes, mate, are going to be so red hot. And they're doing stuff in Pakistan. They've scored 400 runs. They've made 12 weeks in a day or some shit. I don't really care. It's seven first fifth over there. It's none of our business. Um, it's exhibition stuff. It's, it's exhibition. Twos. It's possibles versus probables. Yeah. To see who can play at the top yeah. level. It's just, it's, just a, it's just one of those... It's <laughs> <laughs> can't talk. Anyway, that's our review of day two of the second test match in this meaningless series between Australia and the other team that they're playing against. I can't remember who it is, but it's one of the teams. And if you're in Adelaide watching this and it's before 12 p.m., come out to the live show tomorrow or today. Saturday live uh, show. We'll be feeling pretty good for it. It's a Saturday live show. It's a matinee show. It's 12 o'clock. We're at Hindley Street Music Hall. It's a brand new venue. That's going to be pretty cool. Um, And if you're not there, don't worry about it. Um, Anyway, we will be back in Melbourne tomorrow night, Pez, for reviewing... Uh, day three of this very, very important test series. So, cheers from us. That's going to be very crunchy in the ears of the listeners. Um, but I agree. Fuck them.